Yo, this is Movie with M9V13.com, and today I'm going to bring you the best batting stance that you can use in Road of the Show for MLB The Show 15, and it's uh, Bryce Harper. And something that's real key with getting the swing is to use kind of the tomahawk approach that he uses, and it's really taking a 45 degree angle downwards from that locked up position that he has and just crushing the ball out of there and once you get into that feel of kind of his leg kick and that tomahawk action it makes it extremely difficult for them to even get the ball by you unless it's way off the plate because it's just so easy to to make contact with the ball using the, the X. Uh, you can use the square I mean if you start getting ahead in the count and you really know that they're gonna throw one down the middle you can use that but all these hits are with X and that's pretty crazy when you think about it. You don't even have to use the power swing. You can just hit the regular contact swing. Or I shouldn't say the contact swing. Because that's with O. But just hit X. And you'll be fine. I kind of watch for his knee and his foot. And his hands. And then, uh, yeah, you're just able to, to let it go. And be able to, you know, really hit the ball like a long way. So... It's pretty cool. Bam! There it goes. Over the wall. <laughs> I think they called this one like a, a no doubt one or something like that. But, uh, yeah, this game is pretty freaking awesome. I really like it. But, uh, I've tried a couple different stances out. If you need some other stances, uh, Miguel Cabrera's not bad, Prince Fielder's not bad. But uh, this Bryce Harper one's just the best because you don't have to hit square to get a power hit. All you need to hit is X, and it's just so much easier to. You have such a bigger window to hit the baseball when you hit the X instead of hitting the square. You really gotta time the power square. And why this is just so important is a lot of the times, a lot of people when they hit are really aggressive. They don't want to sit back and wait for the count and with this swing you really don't have to worry about where the ball is also I kind of zoom my camera out a little bit more to give me a better view on the ball so I can just see how it's going in the strike zone faster but yeah even this is the first pitch of the game you can just hit it out of the park you can hit him to left you can hit him to right you can hit like big base hits I've gotten big base hits I've had two multi home run games we just started off I don't know how I kind of thought about Bryce Harper. He had a lot of home runs in one of the home run derbies, but just that action of him bringing that 45 degree angle down. And something else I'd really recommend is get, focus on getting the barrel of the bat on the ball because he hit it on the barrel. Obviously, it's hitting a lot further than he did in some place else. Really wish I had a clip of Bryce Harper in here to, to show you guys. But yeah, this is just one of the player of the game moments, and it's just like <laughs> two home runs in a game. It's a really fun swing, though. Like, you'll be really confident when you play because you know that your guy's gonna, you know, knock the crud out of the ball. And it's a lot more fun too when you can just go up there and almost hit X. And this is on veteran difficulty. I'd like to see more of what's going on, but this is what I've been talking about. Like, you can just fight off bad pitches and fight off bad pitches. I think it says 23 at the start of this at bat. You'll see what the, the end number is at the very end of this at bat. 31, so I've hit off like six, seven pitches. And even after all this, just hit next, you know, 32 pitches. Maybe don't just, just hitting X and hitting X over and over again. You still <laughs> wait back on one and two. <laughs> And just hit another home run. So it's a great swing. Um, I'm interested to hear what other people have to say on what their favorite swing is because there's a ton of them, and I'm sure there's other good ones. Um, but so far, I really like this one. I think it really, there's like always like good and late and all this stuff like that, and I think it gives you a lot of good swings. It's just really easy to time his locked up position and he's really really quick to the ball that's like even that one I probably should have been late but he's so damn quick with that tomahawk that it's good enough but uh, thanks for watching uh, I'll have more videos in the future peace